Hi, I'm Geeta from IHR Consulting. Today, we shall start our series on recruitment with the first topic which is, planning. This series will later continue with topics such as attraction, selection, interviewing, and documentation. As we all know, recruitment is a costly and time-consuming process. Hence, planning and budgeting is essential to avoid further losses to both time and money. Normally it is best to plan on a yearly basis, but changes due to external factors such as economic situation or internal factors such as high turnover may lead to a need for periodical revisions. First step, all organizations must ensure that they have a detailed organization structure, which displays all the job positions within the company. The organization structure should also indicate the numbers of people required to hold each job position. Second step, each job position must have its detailed job description. The job description must consist of the job duties and responsibilities and the incumbent's qualification, skills and knowledge. Third step, there is a need to budget for these positions. Hence, a market study on the remuneration package needs to be done. This is to ensure that the salary and benefits for each position is fair and competitive. Fourth step, as the planning is for a period of one year, it is also necessary to indicate a timeline to fill up each vacant position. This will assist to ensure that the vacancies will be filled on time. Fifth step, propose on a detailed budget which specifies the cost of filling up the vacancies, and the timeline which the vacancies need to be filled by the management. Final step, management will add in other related costs such as advertisement and make changes as seem fit, in accordance to business needs to the proposal. Once the recruitment plan and budget has been approved, the Human Resource Department shall manage the process of recruitment along the budget and timeline given. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you again in our next learning video. Bye.